Hey, what's up, everybody? Rich Von Doom here with Wrestling Figure Epicenter, and get a lot of questions on how to create the lighting truss. So, figured I would dive into that today in the next part of our video series. As you can see, part one was the arena build, the top. We're gonna do this as a part two, and then the underneath locker room area, backstage area for part three coming up. So, stay tuned, subscribe. Uh, this was really easy. Um, this was kind of maybe a 20, 30 minute project at best. So as you can see here, um, basically this is all plastic and this was the figures toy company money in the bank playset. So what I essentially did was I got all four of them. Uh, I zip tied them as you can see here. I put two on each side, made sure they lined up properly. Um, so again, that's the whole thing. I believe it's 18 by 20 or something like that. Um, and then what I did was I took a strip of the monster LED lights that uh, Walmart sells. I think it's for a 64 inch TV or 62 inch, something like that. But anyway, so what I did was I ran them throughout the whole bottom part. Um, Again, to kind of give that illusion that I wanted the focus of the light going down toward the ring area. So what I did was on top, I took regular foam board and I glued them to the top of the, the trusses underneath. So then I essentially what I did underneath was I glued the LED strips. Uh, they're self-adhesive for most part, but I glued them to the bottom as well spot to spot just so they would hold just for added reinforcements. Um, I should go back. Before I did the actual lighting, I took aluminum Krylon spray paint and sprayed the entire thing to give it that shiny metal look. Um, and then I added the lights, obviously. You didn't want to spray it after the lights. So I got the zip ties, I got the foam board, everything then at that point was that complete silver color meshed in. Um, got this all mounted. Mounted that with a regular hook to the ceiling and Home Depot sells this chain that I kind of felt was industrial looking and kind of really gave a feel to the actual truss being a legitimate truss that you would see in an arena. So we tied that all up. I got five different sections, four inches according, uh, four pieces accordingly. I believe they're uh, 14 inches each put a little lift in it and put a couple S cables, the S hooks in there and ran it right up to the ceiling. Um, as you can see, so this controls with the remote. Um, so it's got this little remote here. So once I plug the system in, which I'm not gonna do for you today, unfortunately, I can't get back there. Um, but this flashes in a couple different modes. Um, and it also has an app that you can control it on the iPhone. So um, you can control the colors, the settings, the frequency of, you know, the blip mode, so to speak. Uh, and that's basically it. So this was probably one of the easier things I had to do. Not a lot of difficulty, just again, getting the parts, figures, toy company, the money in the briefcase or cash in the briefcase for copyright issues, I believe they call it. Um, and uh, figurestoycompany.com. I'm not getting any residual from them, unfortunately, but whatever. Uh, <laughs> and then again, a couple pieces of foam board cut, monster LED lights that I got from Walmart. And then the underneath, I ran the wire back there behind the arena and down to the wall so it's plugged in. Uh, I'm probably going to be adding a truss over that soon just to kind of you know hide that and kind of get that going there so there you go there you have it there's the lighting trust 101 and i'll post a couple pictures of it all lit up at the end of the video again if you like what you're seeing keep subscribing hitting that button uh, i got a lot more videos coming up we got the again the backstage arena area parking lot area we also have about four more shelves to do with our custom figures and then we're gonna get into the rings. I have probably about a dozen custom rings with custom ring skirts, highlighting everything from FMW, WCW, old school NWA, uh, WrestleMania, New Japan. So you just definitely wanna stay tuned for that and check that out. But again, Wrestling Figure Up Center, have a wonderful day and talk to you.